Hello, my name is Abe and welcome back to Bellatro. I want to play another challenge run because I had a good time on the previous one. Hey, wait a minute. We unlocked a new challenge run, probably by defeating an old challenge run. Mad World. You start with Paradoilia. It's an eternal negative joker. All cards are face cards. Face cards give you money and then no money. Oh, I mean, this is, it's kind of like a run that we, oh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine only. Very interesting. It's similar to the run that we just played where we don't have any way of generating money except, I gotta learn how to pronounce this too, Periadolia. Periadolia? It's similar to the run we just had except uh, instead of the eggs being the money source, it's just over time we get a lot of money by playing any card. What we would like to see in this run is uh, anything that plays cards again. Peridolier. Peridolier? I think it's Peridolier. Hold on. Peridolia. 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 I think it's close. Peridolia. Um, we're going to play, however, as 15 Minute City. We have Ride the Bus, plus one multiplier per consecutive hand played without a face card. Shortcuts, straights can have gaps, and the deck has double the amount of face cards in it. So you want to not ever play a face card, but it's half of your deck. I don't understand how to build around this, but admittedly starting with a couple of jokers is nice. The problem is that you can't get rid of these, so you're gonna have to build around Ride the Bus, I think. Let's give it a shot. Double tag, holographic joker. We don't have the money to buy anything, so we're not gonna take those. And yeah, these are not negative, so they do take up inventory. I guess we're just gonna have to discard a lot of them, right? So, at least to start with, full house. We would love to have like anything that removes face cards, I think. But I think this is gonna be a, very, a little bit of a hard start, but if you can build that synergy of card removal, I think you'll be happy. Plus eight molt if you have a pair, spades are better. I think I just want two arcana packs. Steel card, Temperance, for $6? Enhance two cards to be bonus cards. We could steal something like a king, and then we can keep it in hand. Well, uh, does, th does this count as, I assume, I assume it means played hand, and not, well, I mean, it says played hand, but I assume that this won't break it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna steal a king. And we'll open the other Arcana pack. This purges our interest, but I think I want the, the value early. Oh, hey, we can make a money card. You know what we can do? Stone some jacks. I think that's an acceptable use of our time. <laughs> Hold on, Pixely says it's Greek, so no weird English vowel juggling. Pereidolia. Look, I don't understand language. Lali, lali lule la. <laughs> e -I -E -I -O. Pixley says, A I O John Madden. I get that reference. I forget the game though. Game. It's um the what is it? It's the the Alpha Space Base or something. It is a flush, but what I would love to see is not a flush and instead another eight, nine, or 10. Although four, six, eight, nine, 10 is a straight because of the shortcut. So why don't we play this? We only need to play two hands anyways. We do get interest, I think, on this challenge, so we should be fine with uh, where we're at, hopefully. That TTS is great. <laughs> um, just give me a three of a kind with stone. Uh, 
I like the fact that in those text-to-speech engines, you can have this like custom notation of changing volume and pitch and length of time, like a certain syllable is being held with like that bracket notation. It's a very like interesting system, you know what I mean? Must play five cards. With Justice and Death, we can hopefully remove some of these, although we don't want to glass these because we don't want to ever play them. We just want them to not be here anymore. So we're going to discard this. We're going to discard this. I'm going to just eh, keep the seven because it's got straight potential. And then if we... Just death, like, queen into five. We have a full house. Although, uh, actually, five, six, seven, nine, ten. Why don't we play this? Because it's a solid straight. We'll play the queen later. Yeah, that seems okay. But, like, convert the queen later when we might need it to make a hand. Actually, why don't we just do this? There you go. Now we make a second glass five. Five, six, seven, nine, ten. I think that's better. We don't want the five to break, but we do want to get rid of the queen, and why not turn it into the best card possible? Spectral pack, oh god. <laughs> I was thinking, hey, we can destroy the- oh, no, wait, that's not gonna do that. I am gonna buy it, though, because if we can hex it, why not? Create a copy of a random joker, destroy all other jokers. Literally, this can't go wrong, although if it copies shortcut, we're not gonna like that. We could also copy uh, five of hearts and get a whole bunch of glass cards in, but like, I mean, what if it, if it dupes something, we can just stab it, right? What if it dupes Ride the Bus? Is that good? I don't know what I'm doing. All right, here's the deal. We just need to get to anti eight and then we can end. <laughs> we don't need to, we don't need to go further than that. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Although I wonder if we could do this with two gaps now. Can we, do we have like a very big extra long shortcut? Let's see, four, seven, nine. Well, actually I don't know if that would work. Nope. No extra long shortcut. Four, five, six, seven. Shorter -er cut. <laughs> Can you not destroy the dupe? No, it's eternal. Can't be sold or destroyed. Three of five Joker slots. <laughs> I mean, at least we're building, you know, around the challenge. We're not playing anything else, but this is stupid. Why did I do that? That's so dumb. Uh, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10. I guess with Shortcut, you really want to be playing a lot of straights. That makes sense. Combs says, I'm really bummed because of the moment I made a comment about Enter the Gungeon, I got a call at work and couldn't hear the stream. Oh, we were just making jokes of, I've played a little. You didn't miss out on too much. Six, six, nine. It's a pair. You play the pair with the the stone? Probably not. We can play the jack to discard it. Try to get a better hand. I do wish that steel happened after the jokers, but it happens before, so 
It gets multiplied and then plus eight. We have another five. That's why I doubled it. Each played ten or four. Upgrade a pair. Honestly, I'm like, oh no! Decreased level of played poker hand. Well, that's terrible! Four, five, six, seven, nine. Straight. Yeah. I feel like this. Might have to play a flush. This run has been terrible. <laughs> Does this allow straights to be made with gaps of two? No, unfortunately. Mm. Well, this is just terrible. I guess we'll high card an eight. It actually will score pretty well. But I, I can't afford to remove Ride the Bus at this point. It's literally the only Joker that we have that allows us to score. Frequent tarot cards? I don't know. I'm surprised we made it past that ante. I'm, I'm, I'm taking a Spectral Pack. I don't know what I'm looking for, but I'm taking it. Destroy five cards in hand. It removed the three numbered cards we drew. Come on. <laughs> this hand, this game, man, lovely. I hate you. I, I legitimately hate you, game. Would or would you not agree that Turbo Rainbow Robot runs are the best way to play the game? The best way to play the game is however you want. Second best way to, way to play the game is BCDD20T as far as I'm concerned. Five, seven, eight, nine, four. Goodbye, five. Six, six, six. Not good enough. All right, we're gonna restart the run, and this time, don't double up on a Joker, because it is bad. It'll dupe your endless Joker, and it will still be endless. What a mistake that was. Uh, you know, I actually think I will skip for a foil Joker. I think that's gonna be worth a lot with Ride the Bus but we don't need rerolls. Hey, Sherbet, welcome, how are you doing? BBC what now? Exclamation mark, BCDD20T. You know, I'm, I'm realizing something else, which is that we might want to purposefully play bad hands to charge the bus, but I'm not gonna do that because I wanna afford a Joker at the next shop. Oh, that didn't even score high enough. But I think we want to buy whatever that Joker is going to be. Oh my god. Four, five, six, seven, nine. Dun, 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 dun. I can do it easy. As long as the chat bot is working. Plus 40 chips for each remaining discard, plus 50 chips. I mean, here's the thing, it's it's good value, at least now. Wouldn't mind the Arcana pack, but next round. All heart cards are debuffed. Five, six, seven, nine, seven, seven, five, five. Discard the kings. Five, 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 six, six. 
Let's do 7-7. Seven, seven. That way we have more opportunities for the straights to still work. Up, up, right, right, down, up. That's the second code. I forget what my first code was. Instructions unclear. I accidentally fired Mega Man shot to the face. <laughs> Playing face cards have a chance to give you money! That's not what we want! This is also not what I want, so just next round me. Negative Joker. I think we need to do this because we need to make up for the fact that we have Eternals. Like, the, the face cards are just... dumb. Six, seven, nine, ten. Four, six, seven, nine, ten. But we got a good synergy here between chips up and molt up. This this will be good for a while. Until maybe like anti four, probably. Okay. Hangman. No hangman. Wheel of Fortune though. It really is a gamble. <laughs> Hermit, doubles money, glass card, creates up to two random tarot cards. Ah, uh, I'm taking the money so we can make sure we buy that next Joker. And I think we can do it. Let's do it. Very good opening hand. Very good opening hand. Okay, we have a negative joker coming up. If you have a three of a kind, you get 100 chips. Didn't we get Wily Joker last run as well? Not amazing, but it's something, I guess. Uh, let's spend down to $15 so we get $3 of interest. Oh my god, am I gonna do it again? No! Make aces! It's it's double removal. Yes! I'm the smartest man! This time I'm gonna Emperor. We get judgment. Yoink. We got Scholar! Okay, well, I mean, that's that's okay, I, I guess. Double Tag might be interested, but I might just... Interesting, but I might just want to fight for it. We have a four of a kind. Sixty times seven or forty times four? I guess sixty times seven. Jug, welcome! Very sad I missed the tiny warm-up. It was a very good tiny warm-up, actually. There were knives everywhere. Okay. Adds double the rank of the lowest card to the multi, times four if you have a four of a kind. I know I just literally played a four of a kind, but that's rare. I mean, like, literally, but also, we don't do that often. Let's take the interest generator. And then I'm um, for four dollars, let's do a celestial pack and level up like a straight. I guess a three of a kind. It's almost like a, fl a full house, but not as much. But more interest. I feel like it can scale very well if we get a lot of interest, don't you? Oh, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. If you contain a three of a kind Wily. Actually, you know what? Three of a kind wouldn't be bad to, to grind for. To the moon, my beloved, says Connie. I, I want to get money. I want to get a lot of money. Four, five, six, seven, ten. You know what? We can use this as a high card discard. Almost a straight discard, but that would cause it to get scored and ruin the bus. So I'm going to go for a ace high card discard. Actually, maybe we should have held on to the ace. I mean, it's a thousand ace. It's not bad. I have one hand. <laughs> All right, pair, pair should do it. We need to, I think we need to work more on three of a kinds though. But we made it, barely. Foreign interest, two per five dollars, 10 max. Well, it's not 10 max. This I think has unlimited maximum, right? Plus two molt per reroll, five dollars if you have a high card, ten bucks for packs. Uh, I'm gonna do it. Stone card, hearts, clubs, joker, diamonds. I mean, another joker could be good, but I think I just want to stone some more face cards. This is gonna cost us two dollars in interest. Actually, you know what? No, give me uh, money. One in seven cards gets drawn face down. Well, here's the, oh my God. Good hand, not what I want. Oh my God. Six and seven are both missing, so discard those. Four, five, except still don't have what I'm looking for. Okay, finally have a straight. Four, five, seven, eight, nine. Problem is that it's still, it's just not good enough. Like a straight doesn't do it. We really do need like flushes. But sorry, not flushes, full houses. This little uh, Wily Joker. And we've already ruined the banner, but at least we get 50 chips. Yeah, I don't know. 1700 hand, we need more. And this is literally high card? Dude, we're screwed. I, I, I'm not sure what to do. I need a pair to discard the jack. Maybe that's what we should have worried about. We should have paired numbered cards to discard face cards to still get score and then also get these out of the hand so we, we don't ruin the bus, right? Because like we need to get a pair. We got a pair. So we can pair and then discard two. It's also not a bad score because of banner ride the bus, but it's not good enough. Two pair. Yeah, I think this is gonna be an R again. This is hard. This is hard because you have, oh, it's very close. You have so many face cards in the deck that you don't want to play. Holographic Polychrome Joker. No, just uh, select me. Although holo holographic would be, polychrome would be nice. Let's do the first one. 
You want to just play a full house? I don't. Four, five, seven, eight, nine. Straight. Anyone in here played Noita Asks Comb? I've played some of it. My friend Chris loves that game. He also streams, he's played a whole bunch of it. I, I, I like Noida. Noida frustrates me in, in ways that, yo, Devious Joker is what we want. Noida frustrates me in ways that have less to do with the gameplay and more to do with like, just bugs. The number of times Noida has just like corrupted and crashed is just frustratingly high. I, I, it's just, it's annoying to me. <laughs> I heard, cherish, the cherish the memory when Abe rage quit after getting screwed by the curse of greed. Well, no, I think what happened was in that particular instance, uh, the game updated and when it updated, it gave me the Curse of Greed in a spot that it previously wasn't there, and it didn't give me the thing that you could pick up to actually purge the Curse of Greed. And so it's just like, wow, okay, whatever, fine. You do you, game. I, I did get frustrated by it, but hopefully it's an understandable level of frustration. I'm going a little bit deep on this. I shouldn't have, but we'll be fine. Popcorn's gonna get eaten. Four of a kind. We're not gonna do four of a kind. Um, plus one card available in the shop. Literally can't do it. I'm just gonna buy the Arcana pack. And I'm glad I did, because we can purge. Ninety percent of Noida is going, what is the worst that can happen, and then having the game spell it out for you. Like, the thing is, is that, like, I understand and I value that experience of you killing yourself in the game via some mechanism or mechanic. But what I don't like is I don't like when the game just kind of, like, bugs out. I get stuck in the train too often. I mean, for me, the bugs are like, uh, hey, this section of the map, you can't enter anymore because the entire block of game memory is invalid and you can't enter it. Like, that's that's what's been happening to me the past couple of times I played it. And it's just like, come on. <laughs> I'm doing the double tag. And give me a buffoon pack. Diamonds are better, four of a kind is better, plus four molts, plus 300 chips minus two hand size. We can't do this, we need to get straights. I'll take diamond molt. We'll give three dollars! Upgrade straight by three levels with the double tag. That's what we need, that's what we need. Four, five, six, seven, eight, yes. Oh, the Diamond Joker, save me. Okay, we're gonna upgrade the straight. Times molt for each blind skipped. We're literally gonna skip the next one, so I'm gonna sell popcorn. Buy throwback. Upgrade straight, buy six levels. <laughs> now we have to play only straights. <laughs> First hand is drawn face down. All right, well, discard me. It's either a four or a five, but it's not a straight. I can play the pair.
four, five, six, six, ten, ten. Play another pair. We're, we're just using this as a discard. I need a seven, eight, nine, ace, two, or three. Pretty much. This will work. Yes, the flaming straight. I mean, you know, we have one discard. Oh, it's so close to a straight flush. Although, hilariously, that's not worth as much as a straight is because it's level seven. Flame effect, man, it's too much. <laughs> and we're not leveling up the bus that much, but I, I don't want to just spend hands, you know? Base card gives molts. Arcana, Spectral. Give me an Arcana first in case we can Emperor. Convert to Diamonds, Multi, Destroy. Well, I think it's still worth it. Let's just destroy the Jack. Although actually, converting to Diamonds is not bad. Yeah, let's let's do it for the multi multiplier from the Greedy Joker, I think. Works as I return from doing a very small amount of exercise. Has the Bellatro wing. Uh, Quirk, if you've been, I don't know if you've been here, but we tried the egg challenge. Now we're on the, what is this one called? 15 minute city challenge. We have a permanent ride the bus and a permanent shortcut. And tons of face cards. Convert to a random suit. Destroy a card to add aces. Add a seal. Add polychrome to a random joker. Destroy all other jokers. It might destroy Devious, Greedy, and Throwback. If it triggers, like if it aims at Shortcut and Ride the Bus, it might try to destroy the other ones, but it can't destroy these two. So worst case scenario, it destroys two, but I don't want to destroy any. I'm going to add aces. It got rid of a nine and added two aces. That's fine. It's not ideal, but. $5 per skipped blind mega standard pack. I, I don't want those. I do want the plus one discard, but I don't think we can actually afford it. What is this? Four, five, six, eight, nine. All I hear now is Weird Al's another one rides the bus. <sighs> I don't remember that one. Too much faces. Yeah, too many faces. I want to buy this, can't afford it. It would be so nice. We can't afford it if we don't buy a Spectral Pack. Sorry. What the hell? Four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. Nope, uh, do it like this, straight. It's not burning anymore, that's a little scary. Kinda tells me that maybe we're not scaling as much as we need to be, but it's still 14,000. Need it. Is that a mega spectral pack? Oh, if only I had the money for that one. Well, you know, actually, I, I could sell something for it. Plus 100 chips at the straight? Dude, I'm selling and I'm buying a mega spectral pack. That's a weird decision. But we get to choose two. Add enhanced faces, convert to a single random suit, add a gold seal to a card in hand. These are terrible. But please pick diamonds. I mean, you know, fair enough. Hmm. 
No repeat hand types. Well, we know what we're looking for. <laughs> Believe. Uh, I, I tried. Five, six, seven. I want to. Well, you know what? Play this then. Five, six, seven, eight, ten. This is a high card ace. Might give us money. Also, scales ride the bus. Didn't give us money. No repeat hand types. Three dollars of held in hand. Sure. Five, six, seven, eight, ten. Uh, we'll just buy another Joker at some point. But that was a. Uh... Spectral packs are way too negative most of the time. <laughs> it could be exceptionally positive. Could also just be essentially worthless. Create a free double tag. Or another spectral pack. All right, let's do it. Create a copy of a random joker, destroy all other jokers. Create a rare joker. Add four enhanced numbered cards. I'm taking the rare joker. Campfire. Sell a card to give it a multiplier. That's not good enough. Played and scores. Just discard the discard. Yeah. Ink Ankh can hand you a win if you get it early. It can. I mean, any Spectral can hand you a win if you get it early and it does the effect that you want it to do. But if it doesn't, you're just like, why did I do this? I just wasted money. I sold a Joker. I got rid of my cash. What? Stop giving me blushes. It's 77788. Full house. That's not enough points, though. We need to get a straight. So I'm just going to play... Not the pair. I'm just gonna play high card 10. Because I wanted to score. Is that the spirit of the game? I think I would just like it if the cards were a little bit more good. What is the, why are you giving me so many full houses? Give me a four, give me a five, give me a nine. There are no more nines, give me a 10. A four, a five, and a, okay. Six, 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 seven, seven. Full house. Give me eight, eight. That way there's actually like gaps. No, it's actually, it's gotta be sevens. Oh, okay, play hand. You just want consistency, consistency shake my head. Well, it's more like, I feel like in a lot of situations, I don't want to play the spectral cards because they're more likely to ruin the run than they are to save the run. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, this could, you know, give me another copy of Shortcut. Mm. And then you just hold R and it's like, okay, well, why did I do this? Temperance, yes. And of course we have the arm show up. Just to be a, a right bastard. High card, ace, hopefully get some cash. And also level up, ride the bus. We did, we got $20. Thank you. Thank you. Pair me. Earn $3. Already pays for this fact that we use two hands. And then four, five, six, seven, nine.
Connie says, you buy spectral packs in the hopes that it does something. I buy spectral packs because the cards look cool. We are not the same. No, uh, I buy spectral packs so I can keep getting 10,000 more souls than you, Connie. <laughs> Convert to diamonds. I'll buy that one. And please give me a straight. What is straight? What is nothing? The truth hurts. Oh, we should have bought this first. I'm a fool. We need to get this for the straight. Ah. Now, Jupiter's flush. Straight must be like Saturn then. a little bit deep, but I'm looking for stuff. Sell the card to disable the current boss blind. You know, we actually have more hearts than diamonds. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. And then we just, we're, we're playing hearts now. Did that not work? You have to sell it in the fight, don't you? Oh, God damn it. <laughs> oh, I'll, one day I'll learn. Four, five, six, seven, ten. Uh, no, eight, ten. Uh, anyways, we have fun here. Yeah, hey, you know, we got the multiplier, which is nice, but goodbye, level seven straight. Hello, level six straight. At least we got through it with one hand, so thank you, Campfire. You actually did get us over the cap would have been 11,000 without it. <laughs> God damn it. All right, booster pack straight. At least we can rebuild it very easily. It is Saturn. Love it says wannabe. This is a very fun game. I do like Bellatro. Let's try to get that banana leveled up. All spade cards are debuffed. That's not a big problem. Nice hand. Um, well, we could play the full house still. Gets us a re-roll. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I accept this. We don't have any 10s, but the 10 is the high end of the straight. We don't have any 5s. Well, we have two 5s, but we can still skip it, theoretically. This can high card me for a chance at the ace. Didn't work this time, but that's that's okay. Uh, discard these. Discard these. There we go. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Need to get more high value straights. But we're getting there. So the banana was safe. We actually don't want the banana to be safe. We want the banana to ripen. <laughs> 
Arcana pack, Jupiter for the flush. I guess we'll, let's try to do this without flushing. We have few spades and few clubs. It's by the sun. Well, I want to purge these anyways. Convert to clubs, make lucky, make steel. We could make uh, face cards steel. That's not too bad. But steel gets triggered before jokers. And it's not like we have lucky cards in the deck. It'll it'll buff the straight. Yeah. We could also just make all of our cards lucky. We've done that previously and it worked pretty well. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go for luckies. I still want to purge the face cards whenever possible. Bum, 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 bum. Oh my god. Too many. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it's a straight. We can convert to hearts. Let's do that right here. Nine, six, seven, eight, nine. We keep the ace and we play the eight. This should be a good hand. A good hand. should sell more cards. I keep kind of forgetting to do that. But I don't want to sell any of the things that I currently have. Create a tarot card if your poker hand is a ace straight. It seems real good. It seems real good. But what the hell do we get rid of? I want the banana to become a times three. I want to get rid of these. But we have an easy access to straights and we have aces. We have two. Oh, but we don't have any twos or threes. We literally can't make it happen. Did I do that? <laughs> Sorry, this isn't like an Urkelism. Did I do that? What the hell happened? Oh, the aces, the twos, and the threes got converted to jacks, queens, and kings. So this is like impossible. What the heck? That's weird. And also highly unfortunate, actually. Dang, man. It's fool. We can upgrade again, multi, or create a joker. I'm just gonna upgrade again. Okay. Spade cards are debuffed. There's like four in the deck. Four, five, six, seven, nine. Make it a ten. Get the money, get the straight. Don't trigger a straight flush, which is not worth as much. And did it in one. 33,000. And banana died, which is good? Weirdly? God, we can't do it. We've played this straight 12 times. It's leveled up to nine. We can't obelisk, unfortunately. Earn $5 if three or more face cards are discarded at the same time. That seems acceptable. What is it, three or more? Well, we can get so much money from that. Odd card gives chips and it also gives chips. It's not worth that much, actually, compared to the value of the straight, 300. This could, at best, buff it by 200 if we have an ace, three, five, seven, nine straight, but we're not going to. So it's worth less than a times two. Maybe campfire, maybe we can buy and sell cards. In fact, you know what? Buy, sell. For $2, we gave ourselves a little bit of a buff. Rerolls start at zero. 15 bucks from a boss blind. No thank you. Okay. Three dollar or three face cards. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're just laundering money at this point. This is one of those jokers where we might not use it forever, but for now it's pretty good. We earned a lot of cash. Devil. And really, this is just letting me fund my planet purchasing. Lost Bind's gonna wreck me. Is it, uh, no straights? What was it? All face cards are debuffed? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Oh, what are we gonna do? Oh, no. Crap. How could you, game? Not my face cards, no. Three dollars if held in hand at end of round. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Straight, do this. Actually, why don't we play this in case we get the money from it? Do we have any other upgraded cards in the deck that we want to draw? No. Okay, play an ace. <laughs> we got the plus 20 multiplier. And nine, eight, seven, six, straight. Clink. 41,000. We're maxing out on our score, which is very scary but we can buy cards and sell them for the campfire. Add the sell value of all jokers left to the multiplier. We're still leveling up the straight. Yeah, like we don't need base chips. Straight's at 400. It's at nice amount. Well, it's at, no, it's at good amount, fun amount. Next round. <clears throat> no face cards. Can we still discard them? Nope. <laughs> Four, six, seven, nine, ten. That's very funny to me. I would have thought it would have at least let you discard them for money, but I guess they're debuffed. They don't count as face cards or something. <clears throat> Anti seven. Blank voucher yet again. Okay. I thought I unlocked whatever this thing was. Wild card money. Better jokers. Went for the better jokers. I regret everything. I regret everything! Yeah, I guess now, now now that we bought the blank one, maybe we can buy a better one. Uncommon Joker, double tag. Must play five cards. We play straights, so that's fine. I'm loving this. <laughs> there we go. Just, just gonna, you know, spend the cards if they're good and they make the deck better. I know it's not a campfire buff, but we have a couple of rounds to buy some garbage for this. these. Buy, buy, reroll, sell, buy, sell, sell. That'll buy us a little bit of time. 
Convert to spades, create a joker, convert to diamonds. I guess we can get the clubs out of the way. That's most of the clubs in the deck right there. Or we could just create a random joker and get rid of the faceless joker, but I really like the money gain right now. Hopefully at some point we will get a little bit more of a value joker. But it's giving us a lot of cash still. Five dollars per discard is pretty good. Ten, nine, eight, seven, five is a straight. Ten, nine, eight, seven, five. You know what? Just take it. We should get over fifty-two. Fifty-two thousand. Yeah. Okay. Ninety-four. Just in case we didn't, I wanted to have a little bit of room in hand. Plus two molt per reroll, odd rank. Magician. And a saddle. Level 15 straight. This is the most straights I've ever played. Plus 20 molt if you have three or fewer cards. Gain one at the end of round. Add the number of times poker, poker hand has been played to the multiplier plus 10 multiplier. So this goes from 34 to 50. Well, to 60, actually. That's not bad. You know? It's a solid multiplier gain. I, I think we like it. I think we like it. It's not quite doubling the multiplier, but it's up there. And it'll scale slightly. But that's a, it's a solid boost to our power, which we needed. Six, ten, a ten ten. Ten ten, then you can discard the queen and you can discard one of the eights and one of the sixes. You play the pair, but you get a, a solid discard out of this. Let's do that. Need to get a seven, a four, and a five, or maybe even another ten to get the straight. Seven, four, and a five. Okay. No, no, no. Lucky card. Hopefully we don't have to play a second straight. I think we'll be fine with the campfire buff. Campfire's not a bad joker to have. Resets constantly, so you have to be buying cards, but we have Theoretically enough money now that we can we can spend a lot just buying and selling planets. That'll help. It's a little late, but we we expect to go further than this. And now it's only one dollar per planet, which is nice. <clears throat> okay. Convert to wild card club or hearts. Well, this just sucks, doesn't it? Tell you what, there you go. Remove all the clubs from the deck. <laughs> I'd rather not have them. I am spending all of my cash. We don't have a money generating card now, so it's a little, little scary. Forces one card to always be selected. Cerulean Bell. That's not too bad, I don't think. Four, five, six, nine, ten. Nope. Four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. Can't believe we've done this without playing a face card once. 33 multiplier on the bus. It's pretty good. Nineteen straights, 570 times 40. <laughs> 
Hanged Man, finally. Mega Celestial Pack. It's only going to be worth one straight. Ah, oh, finally. You know, get rid of the queens. Yoink. Kings, maybe we can strength them later. I completely forgot we had the seven in the deck. We need other cards. There we go. Five, four, six, eight, nine, ten. Actually, that steel card was pretty good value, 240,000 round score. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna do it. Don't ruin me. Don't ruin me. Add a purple seal, a red seal, oil holographic polychrome, gold seal. Whoa, 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 actually, wait, 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 wait. Perfect opportunity for this. We get to choose two? Oh my god. It's the best card. <laughs> Mega packs of spectrals maybe are actually okay. Okay, you want me to discard? I will discard. Eight. Discard again. Six, eight, ten, five, four. Yeah, Cerulean Bell was not that bad. It's my green world again. Don't worry, it's gone. And complete. Endless mode. <laughs> Most played, straight, 21. Arcana pack, Emperor, give me an Emperor. We gotta start selling cards again, but you know, that one's easy. Playing cards can be purchased from the shop. Quark says, Gross Mikael Banana went extinct on the first freaking hand after I got it. That's okay though, you you like ripening the banana because it becomes stronger than you can possibly imagine. Okay, we want to bonus, lucky foil, it's already lucky. So bonus the, I guess save this. Give me a, just a lucky five. Keep the Hierophant so we can use it on two specific cards instead of just one. Continue leveling up our straight, which is a level 19. 600 times 42. Gives a free Spectral Pack. I mean, I'm very tempted, but theoretically, if we get a Spectral Pack in the shop, we can just buy it, you know? Whoa, 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 whoa. We go. Twenty-two straights. I mean, Supernova is worth, you know, thirty plus multiplier right now. It's not too bad. You can destroy sixes. I'm buying this to sell it. The buffed-up hand you got there. I mean, it better be, I'm only playing one hand. We might want to go to straight flushes, but I think at this point, it's gonna be too long to level them up. Well, I guess, I don't have any stone cards. Do we care about stoning them? I guess I'd rather just buff the cards that I have. Because we, we don't care. Stone cards might as well be a face card. We don't want to play them.
because we need to play straights. The exception is aces over kings, because then you can play them for high card for discard, I think. Ashen Rand says, I hate this game. I played lucky cards like 20 times and it never worked. Username says, get better luck. <laughs> I like that strategy. Four fingers would work. Absolutely, but it it's never showed up, has it? Retrigger all played face cards. Lovely. Choose one. Stone card, Joker, $12, planets. Sell that. Emperor, we can maybe sell the cards. Wild card, sell that. I gotta know. Celestial packs always contain the planet card for your most played poker hand. It, is this like the level up of planet merchant, the telescope? Or does it go telescope planet merchant? Or is there another level up to telescope? Or is it its own unique voucher that doesn't have like a second tier? Because this has been wonderful <laughs> to level up our, our amazing straights. Art cards are debuffed. That's annoying, but it's it doesn't matter that much. This is useless. All of them have a second tier. I wonder what the second tier of this one is then. Five, six, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I can at least play this. Six, eight, nine, ten. Telescope's upgrade is amazing, says Connie. I should figure out how to unlock it then, because it might not be unlocked for me. 350,000. I think this is where we call it. I don't think we can scale faster than the antes. Perma permanently gain one discard per round. It's not discovered, so I'll buy it, but recyclomancy. It's, uh, not good enough. Somehow you've just got first tier vouchers, says Connie. <laughs> We're on anti-10. We have... Now we have two discards per round, at least. Oh, you know what? They pair up. Look at that. That's how you know what they are. They pair up. All right, fingers crossed. 560. We're gonna have to start playing multiple hands. So four, six, seven, nine, ten. Four, six, seven, nine, ten. Last time this time, did you figure out the mirror? No, but I've been told not to worry about it. Four, six, eight, nine, ten. Another straight. Okay, <laughs> we need another straight. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, luckily we can play a lot of straights with the shortcut. But it did take three hands to do it. We need to we need something. Right now. Okay. Baseball card over supernova. It's gonna be times 1.5 three times. Throwback's not amazing, but the base play of the straight, I think going to buff it by 37. Ah, maybe you'd get rid of throwback because we've not been skipping too many blinds and we're not going to skip the next one either. But it's this is uncommon, so it actually does stack. This is common. 
This is rare, but we can scale it pretty easily. All right, we're gonna sell Supernova. We're gonna buy the Joker, the baseball card rather. Doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to upgrade my straight twice. And then fingers crossed, a level 24 straight. Seven twenty times fifty, twenty-seven times played, <laughs> and no flushes. So if it if it works, if it counts, if we get an unlock, I would be happy. It's too many eights. Four, five, six, eight, nine. Six hundred and ninety thousand. We might be good for another round. Ten, nine, eight, seven, five. I have to get rid of the this card, but I think it's worth it. Yeah, you know what? Why don't we uh, just discard a few times? Just kind of hoping maybe something else would show up. Maybe we could keep discarding. I'm just gonna take the W. Sorry. The, the dub. <laughs> Poser! Abe's on cool. Buffoon pack. Fortune teller. It's not good enough and we don't have the capacity for it. Thankfully, shortcut's uncommon. But I'm gonna probably just buy the buffoon pack and just see what there what there is. Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe there's gonna be a negative. We have DNA. Pretty good. A little late. Convert to hearts. Double money. Death card. Justice. High priestess. I guess we can death a king? a nine. Gets another one out of the deck. Why not? All diamond cards are debuffed. They will still count four straights at least. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And we have to play like three to four straights anyways just to get over a million. Now that, now that we've got the baseball card, it's a little easier. A little easier. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Yeah, about 700,000 per hand. Now it's probably over. <laughs> Oh, good. Magic trick again. I guess if you don't buy it, it can come back around, which is not what you want. Throwback needs to go. It can't. Baseball card triggers off of it because it's an uncommon. I would have to find another uncommon that is better than this. Lucky cat gains a multiplier each time a lucky card successfully triggers. All face cards become gold cards. Woo! Get me out of here. I guess we could just skip blinds, but. <laughs> Creates up to two common jokers, gives a dollar per played hand. Cards played previously are debuffed. Well, I mean, look, if we can, Let's do it, right? We we got our best card. Seven. As sad as that is. Sigus Jr. says pillar. You, you mean obelisk? <laughs> obelisk would all... Or is this the pillar? This is the pillar, yeah. I thought you meant uh, that... Uh, Joker that gives you buffs as long as you don't play your most played hand, and I'm like, no. <laughs> Four, five, 
seven, eight, nine. Like that'll that'll never work. Let's be honest. Two challenges down. Yeah, the challenges have been fun. They've been a nice change of pace. I feel. Ooh, four, five, six. Hmm. Don't want to play the seven. Six, seven, four, five, six, six, seven, six, seven, ten. Now we gotta get an eight or a nine. That's the only thing that wins it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, seven, nine. I'm gonna keep the ten, that way we only need an eight or a nine, and we can keep the seven. Which means we should dump the six as well. And wait, let's keep the lucky. You know, the lucky cards will maybe win it for us, you hope? We didn't get it. All right, that's fine. Not like I wanted to win anyways, game. You can't handle my strongest cards. Fun round, though. Fun, uh, well, not round, but fun game, though. A straight deck, we played 33 straights, and, uh... You know, made it work with the bus, the bus build. Now I want to take a look at the next challenge because apparently you, you only get five at a time. Lucky tax. Hold minus one cards in hand for every five dollars you have, but you have a 10 hand size. So this is a pure positive if you don't have money. Normal deck. There's one Joker in particular, to the, in particular that I think would be very good with this, and that is the poor Joker, the one that gives you tarot cards when you have three dollars or less. That's a perfect synergy for this. Huge hand size. But there you go, 15 minute city done. Look at that deck. For now, yeah, Vagabond. That's the one. For now, for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe for more, check me out on Twitch for when I go live, support the channel at the various links below in the video description, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of Palatro.